Go ahead. Hello, I'm Albert Baldio. I'm the president of the South Richmond Hill chapter. I'm also the president of the Richmond Hill Democratic Club, and I'm the elected State Assembly District leader of Assembly District 24. I'm here to wish you a very happy new year and a prosperous one, and to make sure that your dreams can come true, to thank you all for your support. Thanks for electing me, and thanks for voting me. As you know, I've been standing up and fighting for you, and we have to fight together. Because in unity there's strength, united we stand, divided we fall. And I'm here to also thank Mr. Ramsaram and, and Mr. Harris for standing up with us and also for making sure that our community can be vibrant, our community can have a voice, and we can have a Merry Christmas. Of course, it's very important that we do for our community. That is what civic duty is all about, and that is why we're here today at the South Convention. At the South Convention today, two basic issues were raised. I spoke to Congressman Jeffries, who's the House Minority Leader, and I told him to revisit the issue on Guyana because there have been a lot of false narratives peddled by Burke and others in Brooklyn about uh, so-called racial discrimination in Guyana and elections interference, which, as you know, all the great countries, all the leading countries have verified the elections were free and fair from Canada to the United States to the United Nations to the Commonwealth. So that issue is already closed. Elections are free and fair in Guyana. So let's put that issue to rest and we call upon Congressman Jeffries to ensure he tells the American government and the Congress uh, to make sure that he preserves democracy or helps democracy in the Guyana. Secondly, for Hindu brothers and sisters, and all of us who celebrate the Wali, the triumph of good over evil, we have asked for it to become a holiday. It was not passed, and unfortunately, the Councilwoman, uh, sorry, the Assemblywoman Jennifer Rajkumar said it was a holiday, which she misled us. It has not been passed. We're going to work and fight to make sure and feed them honest so that the Wali can be made a holiday. Secondly, we call for more resources for the community, we call for more funding. We call for more churches to be given money. We call for more public transportation, for more medical help with the COVID and the triumvirate of sickness and health. Us. We have the highest rate of COVID. We have the highest rate of deaths. And we call for more to be given to us here for schools or hospitals, jobs, wages, a quota of jobs here, also public transportation to clean up Liberty Avenue. The mayor was here today. We told Mayor Adams, you must clean up Liberty Avenue. So brothers and sisters, we continue to fight for you, continue to stand with us, continue to support us. This is Albert Valley, your elected district leader, and Assad Chapter President, and also the Richmond Hill District Leader, and also for the Democratic Club, the President. I'm asking you to let us stand together, let us fight for what is ours, we've paid a lot of taxes. No one's going to do it for us, except if we do it together. I want to thank Roy Ramsaran, I want to thank Joshua Harris for being part of this delegation here today. We will be able to have an avenue to express our voices, express our desires, and express our ambitions. And we call upon government officials to stand with us and to give us our due. Thank you very much, and may God bless you all for the new year. Have a great and wonderful new year, and Merry Christmas.